Hey everybody, Christopher Odd here. Welcome back to The Witcher. You'll notice we're not where we left off last time. That is because I want to go to the graveyard. And in order to do that, it has to be nighttime. So I came to the inn Dang. to see if I could take a little nap and not buy things so Dang. that I could run to the room? graveyard room. at midnight. So that's the plan. Now, from my understanding, I don't think I can actually get into the graveyard because somebody hasn't wanted to clean up the ghouls or something. I can't remember exactly what the gravedigger said, but um, I do have to search for that lady's husband or something, her dead husband, and take care of him. So that's what I'm going to do. I keep looking for Zoltan Shive in here too, but he does not appear to be hanging out in here much anymore. So, forget him. I'll find him at some point. And I actually, I think we're actually pretty close to the, uh, the graveyard. We are. Oh, what is this? I'll help these guys. Boom! How's that, boys? No? Nobody even gives a crap? I just got like a bunch of bat wings or something nutty. What was that? Right here. Wing membrane. Sweet. Okay, that's the first time I've seen like a monster like all up in the city here. That's pretty cool. Anyways, uh, what I do want to say is thank you guys very much for uh, the support on this series. I actually am really enjoying it for a couple of reasons. Whoa. Uh, one is that uh, I don't really know what to expect. I have no clue where the story is going to go, what's going to be involved. Like, I just have what's no this? clue. Oh, there he is. Wraith? That must be him. Let's clear out a couple of these first. Okay. Now this guy. Oh, hello. I go group. Whoa, what the hell was that? Whoa. God, that stun is so huge. Have to click. Find at the cemetery at noon. Okay, I can do that. Now. What I was saying is, I have really no clue what to expect. Literally, around every corner of this game, I have no friggin' clue what's going on. And I absolutely love that. I love that there's so much that's going to be open for interpretation. So much gray area. Like, it's freaking great. I cannot overstate that enough. What I'm looking for is, uh, from you guys, if you can tell me... Is it mostly like hub based, like we're in the city and we have all these tiny quests to do? Or does it start to open up and become more, uh... Like I'm curious as to what's going on, like without spoiling it, what kind of things can I expect? That would be really interesting for me. So we're wondering why I'm going back to the Harry Bear Inn. It's because uh, now I'm going to rest till noon and go meet that lady there at the cemetery. And maybe uh, Zoltan will be in here too, but my luck. Damn. Any room? Five or... I'll also see if I can do any leveling, but I don't think I can. Yeah, I got nothing going on there. Maybe some alchemy. No, I also don't have anything going on there. Like, it would be nice to make some, uh, some swallow. What am I missing? I don't have any bases. Is that the issue? I guess. All right, I just got to keep rocking then. Okay, I'm going to meditate till noon. Then go meet the lady about the dead about the dead guy and the thing and the money probably. Oh, I realized I didn't even try to go into the actual uh I didn't try to go into the actual cemetery. But I think it's locked anyways, if I'm not mistaken. It's locked because I have to get a quest for it or something. Somebody has to want to clear it out. 
Uh, okay, Carmen, you talked me into it. Nice to. Let's do this. I have a serious problem. Another thing you guys mentioned is that you'd like to see me do the dice game. Ooh, that is a nice roll. And uh, I will do that. Oh no. Oh no, that's good. You guys want to see like, cause I want to make some serious cash doing this. Cause I think if I could just get on a roll with the dice game, make a whole bunch of money and then I could buy whatever I want. I think that would be great. Uh, that being said, I'll probably have to do a whole episode on it. And some people have said they'd watch that. So <laughs> I'll do that at some point. Boom, she just like folded. Wasn't gonna mess around with that at all. Come on, nothing really. A couple threes. Ah, oh, she's not better off. Let's go, let's raise the stakes here. I'll take another three. A three of a kind seems to be pretty rare in dice poker. There it is. I just have to hope she doesn't get like a full house or something nutty. I'll take it. Boom. Check that out, 396 big ones. All right, enough of that. The other thing I will say is, uh, in addition to thank you guys for watching this, is uh, a lot of people have been um, asking if I'm gonna play The Witcher 2, and yes, absolutely I'm gonna play The Witcher 2. Uh, sometimes people ask me, like, are you gonna play this game or can you play this game? I usually don't respond to those comments because I try to keep the discussion in the game uh, comments specific to that game as much as possible. So I'm not ignoring you, but I kind of am. But that's why. <laughs> Speak softly or someone will spot us together. Oh, you mean like the gravedigger or the boy there? I've dealt with your husband. Have you proof? You didn't mention proof. I want my gold. You're depriving a widow of her Oh, pittance. this chick. Quiet down. No wonder he killed himself. Aren't you afraid of being seen in the company of a witcher? Damn you. Take your gold and be gone. Hildegard. My god. She tried to get me out of my money. Cheat me out of my money. Yeah, locked. Okay. Let's see. I think he's got a thing to tell us why it's locked. What do you need? Why is the cemetery shut? Because the dead refuse to rest in peace. Fear not, they stay in their graves in sunlight. Someone should tend to them, though. Perhaps someone will offer a reward, but for now, no one seems bothered. Yeah, okay. So there it is. I'll deal with it when you think putting a dead body to rest is easy. Won't hurt to check. What do you need? Farewell. 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 Now I think... I think it is finally time to head to the dike. Uh, my practical side says I should really buy some stuff to get some potions, though. How do I want to handle that? That's way over here. I'm gonna tr I'm gonna try to handle it without getting a whole bunch of potions. Do I have any? Let's sort this thing. I think I've got. Yeah, I've got one swallow, which is pretty fantastic. Flutter fangs. Ooh, okay. Let's see what these guys have going on. Need any? When did you join the order? A while ago. My father was an armorer, and I after him. Okay. Will you sell me your wares? I only work for friends of the order. Bye. Yeah, but I think his buddy does. Sir. Can I have a look? Forgive me, sir. We sell only to the order's friend. Farewell. God damn. I thought that... I don't know. Didn't that one dude, Siegfried or whatever, didn't he, like, hook me up? Must not have worked very well. Okay, so before we go out to the dike, there's a couple of things. Uh, we're just gonna do a quick review of where we're at here. A game of dice, uh, Zoltan, can't find him. Five Sephiro, I think that's out in the dike. Yes, it is. Ferengar's Secret, Ask the Swamp Dwellers, that's out in the dike. 
Dice poker, fist fights, memory of a blade. Talk to Zoltan, but I can't find him once again. Uh, Shani owes me one. She's here. Not a big deal. Go to the dike where I can find Merchant Luvarden. He's also a guy I have to ask questions of about Azar Javed, so that'll be interesting. Uh, all these suspects are just closed until I find new evidence, except for Luvarden, because I have to talk to him. I need more evidence regarding um, Vincent. These are all just different contracts, so I need to catch Al Ghul's dog tallow, which I probably won't do because I don't like just killing the dog straight up. Uh, ten drowned dead tongues for Siegfried. The Econops contract for the gardener. I go to the dike to see Coleman. That's obviously at the dike. Wolf pelts for Jean Pierre. The Zima confidential. I need to question the merchant Louvarden. I just speak to the messenger of the man who rewards people for killing salamanders. So that's the guy that gives us money for salamander brooches. And I reckon I should search for leads on my own. Last but not least, the overall investigation into Vizima, uh, which should lead me to Azar Javed. So, lots of stuff happening out in the dike. Here we go. I've been talking about going here for a long time, but it's, uh, it's, you know, we've had things to do. Oh, good. And if that's all I saw, you'll lose half your gold. Wait, someone's coming. It's that white-haired fellow. He spotted us. Careful. What? He's a witcher. He's dangerous. Finally, the acknowledgement I deserve. <laughs> Witcher! That seemed like a nice chat. Stop playing the fool. You know. Matter of fact, I do. By the way, you never paid me. Here's a hundred orings. Yeah. Don't turn me in. That's right. Not. I'm helping Vincent dismantle the secret salamander organization. Oh, interesting. You're not doing too well. Oh, some fool keeps killing salamanders, spoiling our traps and schemes. <clears throat> Any idea who? No, but if I find him, I'll stop his meddling. <laughs> it's me. If I want to expose Coleman, I must go to the innkeeper. Witcher. Yeah, he's the fist tech guy. All right, we're good. 20 each, so everything sells back at one-fifth, I believe. Witcher! Tell me about the effects of Fistech. In small doses, it lifts your spirits. Large ones cause euphoria, maybe aggression, but relieve pain and fatigue. Looking for fun or entering the business? Neither. So long. Okay, so what I'm gonna do... I know I said I'm going to the dike. But I'm gonna run back to the innkeeper, just so we can keep everything, uh, in a row here, and on point. So, what's the best way to get to the inn? Okay. I'm gonna kinda tattletale here, but whatever. It pays. My Hello, everybody, in the lower depths of Zima. You rat dwellers. Damn it. Whatever you do, don't bet on the boxing. It's rigged. What do you want? I found Coleman. I found Coleman. Oh, Ram's meat will fancy knowing that. Huh. I caught him informing. Bastard. We knew of a leak, but Coleman? Absolutely. That's life. The drug Ram's addict. Ram's meat set a price on the snitch's head. 500 orans. Ooh, I like that. All right, I think... I think I should probably... Oh, uh, there's not really much I can take. Bottled water, unknown oil, unknown bomb. Let's see, I'm gonna move all these to storage. 
That gives me a decent amount of room. Should be okay. I've got this bind weed potion. Not sure how that works. Anyways, that was a quick 500 bones. I don't feel bad ratting him out. He had life problems. He was... He was on fist tech and he was dealing fist tech and like... In a way, I think I helped him. Unless they killed him. Which is possible. Let me see if I can talk to Ramsmead about it. Looks like I have to deal with these idiots. Ah. Uh, Alright. We'll leave him for now. I really wish that you could take out your sword in the daytime. Like, just for running, because it makes it way faster, but it's all good. Okay, back to the dike. Thank God for fast loading times. And dike. Coleman's gone. Ooh, the harbor whore. She seems nice. Hello. I believe Carmen mentions you. Possibly. I did her a favor. She also said what you'd bring. What? Oh, flowers, I think, right? Is that what I give to these ones? I know someone who won't be interrupted. Lead the way. Dun, dun, dun. Close your eyes, kids. What does she have in her hand there? Not the look of me. Well, that was fun. Characters, prostitutes. Shall we read? I think we shall. We've already read through all of these, but when I did the read through, I don't think I actually saved it. Uh, yeah, we've read all of these ones. Where's prostitutes? Right here. Zima's Temple Corner offers joys aplenty to those who can afford them. Okay, that's just super. Here's Luvarden. We gotta talk to him, and he has a job for us. Do I have? Yes, I do have a torch. That's a good sign. I'm a rassler, not a ditch digger. Okay. Yes? A lot of these guys look the same. It's weird. Uh, let's see what he's got, first of all. I'm gonna buy some more flowers, because... <laughs> why not, right? And I'm not gonna sell anything, because there's nothing to sell. So... Yes? I heard creatures threaten the transport of goods. Yes, uh, I assume you're not asking for curiosity's sake. I'm hoping someone will pay for their removal. I may. The dog by the swamp is crucial to my business. The creatures have caused me losses. What are the beasts like? Drowners. They emerge at night, destroying goods and murdering carriers. I'll pay 400 orans to be rid of them. That works for me. A pleasure doing business. Indeed. I've killed those before, so that shouldn't be an issue. Let's talk. Yes? Okay, this guy knows a lot of stuff here. Um... I suspect you know about Salamandra. I know nothing. Bullshit. We'll see. Can I return to my business? We need to talk about your dealings with Salamandra. You paid to have the professor released. <laughs> Why would I bother with a criminal? Why not? Would I do it so clumsily as to implicate myself? Uh... I don't believe you. I don't have any definitive proof, so I'll let it lie <laughs> for now. Wise choice. You should trust your instincts more. I do. Yes? I wonder if you have to go through all of the, uh... Like, you have to go and investigate everybody, or if you found, like, if there is some certain piece of evidence, then would you be able to just accuse these guys based on that? I have no clue. I seek the Sephiroth stones. I haven't yet located them all. I thought you might know such art and oddities. I once purchased one for its magical potential, which turned out false. And I paid a mage a costly sum for the examination. Then would you sell it to me? Sell my Tiparath? <laughs> 
I'm rather fond of it. I'll give you a good price. 500 orms? I didn't think it was worth so much. But all right. I wear Tipperath as an amulet. We can deal right now. I have 500 orans, though it's quite a price to pay for a stone. I sadly relinquish it, but my reputation would suffer, as would my business, if I did not deal. The Sephira is yours. Nice. So did I pay him? I did pay him. Must use a boat to get to the swamps to rid the monsters. Must wait for Raymond to contact me. I'll reopen the case if I find new evidence regarding Luvarden. I found six Sephiroth. Just four more to go. Okay. That was a lot. We covered off a lot of ground there. Uh, I'm going to take a break here. We are now in the dike. It's a nice place, actually. There's birds and seagulls, mostly, I assume. And some guards protecting some barrels. So this uh, would be a lot of trouble to get into, I imagine. I just want to say, uh, once again, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.